Big news for Manchester United fans as the Premier League has officially ratified the deal for Iron EOS, the company owned by Sir Jim Ratcliffe, to buy a 25% stake in the club. This deal, costing around £1.3 billion, will see Ineos take sporting control of the club and also invest £00 million into improving United's infrastructure, including Old Trafford Stadium. However, it's important to note that the Glazer family, who have owned United since 2005, will still remain in overall charge of the club. This deal is not the complete buyout that many United fans had hoped for, but it does bring fresh impetus to the football side of the operation and marks the first outside investment in the Glazers' nearly 19-year ownership. As part of the deal, Sir Dave Brailsford, the former mastermind of cycling's Team Sky, and Iron EOS Sport Chief Executive John claude Blanc will join the board. So, what does this mean for the future of Manchester United? Well, Ineos will have the casting vote on any decision related to football, such as transfer policy or the future of manager Eric Ten Hag. They will also assess the suitability of Ten Hag for the role of manager. Ineos executives, including Brailsford and Blanc, are expected to play influential roles and implement changes to improve the club's operations. In terms of finances, Ineos will have to adhere to the Premier League's financial fair play rules, which require clubs to limit their losses and not exceed certain spending limits. However, with Ratcliffe's wealth and the cash injection from Iron EOS, United should have little to worry about in terms of breaching these rules. Overall, this deal represents a shift in dynamic for Manchester United, with Ineos bringing fresh investment and potentially new ideas to the club. While it's not the complete buyout that some fans had hoped for, it does offer a new chapter for United and the potential for further improvements in the future.